My name is Mercedes Murat. I'm an artist representing Sweden in the 2019 Florence Biennale. I've been a full-time artist for over six years. Uh, I've had exhibitions in uh, Sweden, Finland, Norway, USA, and this is the third time I've exhibited in Italy. Once in Milan and the second time now here in the Florence Biennale. I work as a furniture artist and also a painter. I create unique glass paintings uh, within a technique that's called ver eglomisé. It's a very old technique and very unusual within contemporary art. So what I do is that I'm behind the glass, painting from the other side, uh, with the, starting with the end and then moving my way backwards. So the finishing step that I make is to put the background on. And between these layers, I also polish in 24 karat gold, uh, white gold, platinum, and mother of pearl. I love to work with these noble metals uh, and materials because they are both strong and delicate uh, and also are making my paintings change depending on the natural light in the room. So in the morning it's one kind of painting and in the evening it's another one. And these unique glass paintings that I make don't usually need any particular light except the natural light because real gold is a light source just by itself. The painting that I'm exhibiting here in the Florence Biennale this year is called Aurora. It has 24 karat gold, white gold, it has platinum, mother of pearl, and moon gold. The fact that I create these paintings from the other side of the glass makes it uh, a completely different style and look on this side, uh, which is, can be very interesting for me as an artist because I spend all this time creating these pieces from the back side. And it's not until I move over to this side that I actually see the final result. When something reflects in reverse, it becomes something totally different. It's truly a real honor to be invited back by the international jury to exhibit my art here in Florence Biennale for the second time. It has been an, such an amazing experience just as two years ago because now I have a worldwide network that is so strong and beautiful amongst artists, uh, art dealers and visitors from all around the world. Also Florence as a city, I think if you're an artist you need to experience it because it's not just in the art museums that you get inspired and discover all these things. Um, you get inspired just by walking around in the city.